Good evening and welcome to Archbishop Reardon High School, home of the Crusaders. Uh, tonight we have the visiting Sacred Heart Cathedral Prep Fighting Irish facing off with the Reardon Crusaders in the opening of the WCAL Wrestling Tournament, uh, Tournament League. The referee for this evening, you can see him on the corner of the mat there. That's him. <laughs> That's uh, hey, Ronnie, Ronnie Coffrin. Our visiting Irish coach is Jack Schindler. Jack is in his second year as the head coach. And uh, he's taken over the program. He's done a great job. They've uh, really improved the program. He's one of the mentors in San Francisco. He runs the San Francisco Wrestling Club and uh, very involved in, in wrestling here in the city. Gary's in his fifth year. Last year, Gary led his team to a three-way tie for first place at the top of the WCAL. There's your flip. It's going to be green. And that's going to be Sacred Heart. I don't know if they got it out or even, but we'll find out when we get into that first match. Reardon will be red. Cathedral will be green. Good duck under. Bigler with a great duck under. He gets two points. There's a good takedown, a double leg, and he's underneath, behind. Another two points. There's 22 to 7, and that's going to complete the technical fall. That's 15 points right there. 15 points, technical fall at 101. From Michael Bigler. Bigler over Mateo. We'll take a break. We'll be back right after this. Another front head trap by Colby Dobson. Dobson trying to get behind. Doing a good, good job. Fionn trying to turn in and face him. Dobson gets Dobson gets his takedown. Fionn, you don't want to do that. You're going to your back. You're in trouble. And there's a pin with two seconds left in the period. Woods needs to put a half Nelson in. There's the half Nelson. Woods could turn him. Woods has got plenty of time left. 46 seconds. It looks like he's in trouble. Brutus flat back. That should be a pin. And there's another pin. So it's Garcia and Villanueva at 126 as we get underway. It's like a table trying to have four legs. Right now, there he's coming up. He's doing a good job. He got himself an escape, one escape. So it's two to one. And right off the bat, Woods goes for a single leg, a low single leg, and he's able to sweep and convert. There's a one-point escape for Munoz. Makes it two to one. Munoz trying to change the level. A little too slow. He gets caught with that head trap. There's a takedown. 6-2. A 10th grader. So we've got two 10th graders here. Giovanelli and Amador. Vanelli almost converts, but a rever he reverses it. Amador reverses it and gets the takedown. There he goes. He's able to get it. Amador now has a head and an arm. It's in favor of Amador right there, squeezing it up. All he needs to do is sit there. Excuse me, the 12th grader. He's the 12th grader, and Dante was the 10th grader. Against Antonio Nathan Miranda. Nathan Miranda in purple. Giovanelli in green. And there's a takedown for Miranda. Randy, the 10th grader, the younger. He has an older brother who we'll see in a little bit. Right there is a takedown. Good work. Limp arming right there. Getting the takedown is Randy Averett, the sophomore. There is a throw, and it slips. Averett does a great job of slipping that, putting Saxton on his back. 30 seconds left here in the first period. Still score 1-0, and that one point was 
on a penalty. Well, there's two-point takedown, just as I spoke. Two-point takedown for Lamb. Lamb has no control. Right there. There's the takedown. That should be a takedown. Finally. Mulwall with the takedown. Ties it up. 3-3. Three, three. Angelo from Reardon. Ombre from Sacred Heart. Angelo's got to get off his knees. But that's what's going to happen. He gets taken down. Two points green. Ombre trying to ride. Tries to roll through. Not the thing you want to do. There's a reversal. Two-point reversal. And we're back for the 182-pound weight class. Kiev Trinidad, the 12th grader from Sacred Heart versus Gene Aberet, the 12th grader from Reardon. Aberet, an outstanding wrestler. His record so far this season is 15 and five. Second in the Weber Lawson, eighth in the Lovell Classic, second in the Matt Classic. He's ranked sixth in CCS at the 160 pound weight class and was a second place finisher in the WCAL last year. Rogan, head front trap, snaps it down. Does a good job of spinning behind and gets a takedown. Morris hanging on to a leg. There it is. That should be it. Russell trying to stay in bounds. Wilson just trying to force him back down, forcing him out. Again, pushing him out. That's going to be another one point. So the score is two to two. Now late. Russell with a single. No takedown. Oh, I take that back. Takedown two. Takedown two. Russell with the takedown. Makes it 11. That's a seven point differential with 15 seconds left. If he can put him on his back, making an eight point differential, that's a big difference here. I think he's just going to be happy riding this one out. As he does, he gets a decision. Raymond Russell with a decision makes the score 27 to 33.